Week two of the NBA season is here, and we're breaking down who's rising, who's falling, and who might shock everyone. Let's start with number five. At number five, we've got the New York Knicks. The front office went all in this summer, adding Mikael Bridges and Carl Anthony Towns. But even after getting hammered by the Celtics in their opener, they crushed the Pacers. So yeah, still work to do, but the potential is big. Can they handle the pressure? Only time will tell. Sliding in at number four are the Minnesota Timberwolves. Last season, they made waves with a defense that just wouldn't quit. Now, with Julius Randle backing up Anthony Edwards, they've got a new one-two punch that's keeping the Wolves hungry. Don't sleep on Minnesota. These guys are out to prove they're the real deal. At number three, it's the Cleveland Cavaliers. They're off to a hot start, dominating without even facing the big dogs of the East. With new head coach Kenny Atkinson at the helm and their defense firing on all cylinders, Cleveland is looking sharp. Watch out for these underdogs. They're here to shake things up. At numero dos, it's the Oklahoma City Thunder. This team made some subtle but brilliant moves, bringing in Isaiah Hartenstein and Alex Caruso. The result, a terrifying defense that even gave the Nuggets a hard time. With Shea Gilgis Alexander in the mix, OKC is looking like the team to beat in the West. These guys are for real. And holding strong at number one, it's the Boston Celtics. Kicking off their title defense, they tore apart the Knicks, then breezed through two more wins, all without Chris Stepps Porzingis. Meanwhile, Jason Tatum seems like he's on an MVP mission after that Olympic snub. The Celtics are still the team to beat. So there you have it, week two's NBA power ranking, but it's a long season and things can change fast. Who's gonna hold their spot and who's gonna fall? Stick around because the season is just getting underway.